Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. I'm heading out to a lake that I've never actually put my kayak in. I've only ever ice fished it and I've done pretty good ice fishing it, but we're gonna try bass fishing it for the first time. So hopefully we can catch something. It's been pretty nice out lately. It's um 55 today, roughly 55, and it's kind of been high 40s this week. So, but before that is 30s and this coming week is supposed to be 30s again. So hopefully we can maybe get on a bite or something, I'm not sure. I know there's a big pike in here. I've caught a couple, and I caught a nice one a couple years ago, but we'll, we're gonna see how we do. And I'll pick you guys back up when I get on the water. This water's kind of scaring me how much there is in it. It'll fly off. Gosh dang, I thought that weed would fly off. Starts to sink, we're going to frickin' paddle to shore. But, just got a little Ned rig on. This is gonna be, we're gonna fish this super slow. See if we can get a bite. See, out in that big lake, it's windy, but these trees are blocking me, so it's not as bad. guys so as you can see I'm not on the water anymore the wind was probably blowing like 25 30 miles an hour and trying to control a kayak in that sucks does not work I tried to go in that cove like you guys saw but it was still getting in there so I'm trying I'm gonna head out or over to a river that's around me I'm gonna there's a couple spots down the river that I can hit and I'm gonna see if we can go catch some fish there because that was not working out it was blowing. It was blowing so bad. I, I couldn't do anything. I would go to cast and have to sit there and uh, paddle around to get back to where I need to be. And then by the time I do that, I got to reel in my line because it's all over the place. But I'll pick you guys back up when I get to the river. Okay, guys, so we made it to a part of the river. Um, they've changed it a lot since I've been, last been here, but... I'm going to walk down this hill and there's rocks and stuff, I think. And then they got a spot over there that's blocked off and it's like almost like a spillway part of the river, but never I didn't know they were doing that and I, I don't know how to get over to that side. But we're going to try right here and if I can't catch them right here for after a little bit, I might move to a different spot where I might just continue fishing here and hopefully catch something. So I'm only bringing three rods. I got my jig, my crankbait, and my jerkbait. This looks like it's been, oh my, it's gonna be hard. Come on, might only be fishing right here. Last time, all this was rocks and it was so much easier to get down here and there was so much more room to fish. platform I guess. I'm gonna start out with the jerk bait. It's just a jerk bait time of year right now. Gotta be careful of these trees behind me. It doesn't eat this. Really surprised. I struggle with fishing rivers because like, I don't know. 
I never know what to throw. Okay, we're going to go down one way or the other. I'm going this way, I think. Oh gosh, I don't want to roll my ankle. Oh, there's an open area. We're going to try down there. See this one I'm talking about, kind of stagnant water, it kind of circles out. This would be good if I was floating by or something that I'd cast right here with me being on top of it. Kind of no point of casting right there. Oh gosh, there's a hole. That's sketchy. I want to go down farther if I can. It's kind of sketchy because I don't know something could jump right out of these rocks. I'm gonna try right here with the jerk bait. I'm confident I can catch one on this jerk bait. If I want to keep throwing it, it's just. it to the new spot walking down here there's a little spot where I can go down at and fish up by this waterfall I'm hoping nobody's down here but I've caught smallmouth out of here pike out of here still just bring the three rods again That water's running. Usually it's not going this fast. I don't think, at least. I don't know, I guess we'll see. up here oh I guess not bad oh. throwing the jerk bait starting out with that again I need to slow it down No, 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 where am I snag? Oh yes, it came off, it came off, let's go, let's go boy, let's go. I like this grip, this grip is super grippy, it makes it really nice. I can feel it, it's running across rocks and everything, bouncing off of them. I'm 
No. No. Come on. I tried to reel so it wouldn't do that. Come on. Come on. No. Let's see if I open the bail up. I know what stick it's on. Come on. It's probably lodged in there now. Maybe if I go way over here. Please. Come on, please don't break. Please pop. Oh, I'm bringing that tree in. Oh my. Biggest catch of the day, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Got a tree pounder. Oh, first catch of the year is a big old tree pounder. Ow. I can see my, yeah, my bait's right there. I'm not getting, oh yeah, big old tree pounder for the first one. Oh, but he got off. Gosh. That was probably, I don't even know how big. Oh my, we're gonna fall on our butts and get really soaked. Confident, this cast right here, 10 pounder. Not a tree pounder, a 10 pounder. Or maybe a three pounder. Or maybe a two pounder. Oh my. Oh, they're getting it. Oh, oh. I don't know what that is. Oh, I thought I was gonna get caught in that. Oh my. Need a new pair of shoes? Yeah, I surely don't. Come on, fishy. 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 Oh my. Where's the 10 pounder? New state record. So I'm trying to catch here. Or anything that works too. I'll take any fish right now. I'm gonna reel it before it hooks that. Oh yeah, come here, there. Do your dance, do your dance. One, two, buck my shoe. Three, four, shut the door. Five, six, pick up sticks. Seven, eight, let me catch a fish. We're going crazy, boys. We're going correct. No, no, no. Really thought I got snagged there again. Sorry for that freaking whistling noise. Come on, fishy, come on, fishy. Thank you. 